What's up guys, welcome back to The Educated Barfly. Today we're gonna to be making a really nice, awesome, very refreshing uh, Aquavit cocktail called Sistema Natura. It is It was created by bartender uh, Melina Bickford, who is actually now the uh, brand ambassador for Ehus Aquavit. And so we're gonna be using some Ehus Aquavit, which is really traditional uh, Swedish uh, Aquavit. If you guys don't know what Aquavit is, Aquavit, or uh, which means water of life, Aquavitae, which means water of life in Latin, is a um, spirit that basically has been being made by monks since the 15th century. It, it basically, they took a whole bunch of just like uh, botanical elements, their own secret blends of botanicals, and they macerated it into a uh, clear spirit. And it is thought to have mystical properties. It is something that is drank a lot in Sweden, Norway, and Denmark although those different places have their own different styles of aquavit. And they also, to make Swedish aquavit, you have to adhere to a strict set of legal requirements. Firstly, it has to be made in Sweden with uh, Sweden's own uh, pristine water supply. On top of that, it has to be uh, mainly flavored with caraway and or dill. And it has got to be produced at 37.5% alcohol by volume. That is the rub on Aquavit. Um, it is a wonderful spirit. Uh, we are getting into summer hot months and we are in full spring. Spring has sprung, as they said, as they say. So let's get into making this cocktail because I'm super excited to share it with you. So the first thing we're going to do is get some celery bitters. Today we're using scrappies and we're just going to do three dashes of celery bitters. We are using one and a half, 1.25 ounces of Granny Smith apple juice. Now, Granny Smith apple juice comes out really pale green. I have let this sit for about 15 minutes and it is already oxidized, so it is a little bit of a different color, but that is okay. It is still wonderful. It is good and wonderful and very tasty. And uh, I juiced this fresh, as should you. So we do 1.25 ounces. Then we do three quarters of an ounce of lemon juice. And in proper bar fly fashion, we have no simple syrup. So let's go to our fridge and obtain it. Pouring our one to one simple syrup from a jar. You should label everything um, today because we're being, we being classy. We're doing three quarters of an ounce of simple syrup. And then two ounces of Ehus Aquavit. We're going to add some ice to our shaker. Lock our tin and shake. As this is a little bit more voluminous of a cocktail, we're using a tad more voluminous um, glassware. And this one is actually vintage, I believe, that Marius picked it up at a flea market. And it is a nice one. It is either that or Ikea. No, no, I think this is a vintage one. It's a nice one. I like using vintage glassware, even though it kind of, you guys are like, oh, well, I can't get the glassware. But you know, you just want a glass that's about eight. I think this is about seven ounce glass, six and a half to seven ounce glass for this particular cocktail. And then we are going to, now it has come into fashion to clip things to the side of cocktails. I see it on Instagram all the time. I see a lot of my bartending compatriots do it. We're gonna do it for this cocktail because the garnish is a celery peel. So basically I took a peeler and peeled some celery. And we're gonna just make a nice little shape with it. All right? And stick it on our glass, like so. And is that sitting the way I want it to sit? Yeah, there you go. And there you have it. Okay, let's taste it, guys. Oh man, that is like. Oh, dude, I have crushed these all day. This is, mm. all right, so that is, you get the apple, the lemon gets the nice, the apple kind of gives it like a nice sort of tart, very fresh taste, but then the lemon 
kind of adds a little bit more of that like citric bite with a little more body. Ah, but what's great about this is the juxtaposition of the dill and fennel mixed with those fresh, bright um, flavors. And then you've got the simple syrup sort of, you got the simple syrup uh, just kind of balancing it all out and making it like nice and not sweet, not at all sweet actually. It is, I mean, you feel the sugar in that, but mainly it's only balancing out those really tart flavors. It's very tart, very bright, and you've got those nice sort of that like fennel, sort of dill flavor kind of bringing up the back end. There you have it, my friends. Sistema Nature uh, from Molina Bickford. I will see you guys on the next tutorial. And thanks for stopping by. Hit like and subscribe if you want to. I'll see you later.